everybody, Ace Trainer Liam here, and welcome to the latest episode of the Pokemon Sun Wonder Trivial Arc. We're going to go chat with Ilima about the uh, completion of our trial. Answer me the question of the day, which is going to be... Which Pokemon's type would you change? Which Pokemon do you think has an incorrect or has a type that should be slightly different? I still think the Flabebe line should be uh, Fairy and Grass because they're literally flowers or attached to flowers, but what do I know? But answer me it in the comments below. And also, sorry about yesterday's episode. It got a copyright notification from Nintendo for 34 seconds of footage. Featuring Alolan Gumshoes arriving, good old content ID system at work, so that was re-uploaded. Go show that video some love, go give it a like and all that jazz so it can go back to its former glory. But anyway, greetings, Captain Illuma here. I know who you are. As you travel around the islands of Alola, you'll find captain's barricades here and there. These barricades are mark areas where particularly strong Pokemon can be found. Anyone can pass through them, of course, if they're escorted by a strong trainer. Those attempting the island challenge can pass the barricades as long as they clear the trials. Are you ready? Then behold the power of a captain. Alright, here you go. Let's move this for you, mate, so you can go through. Well done. Lovely. Yeah, that's my only job. Voila, your world just got a little bit bigger. Am I the only captain here on... I am the only captain here on Mele Mele, Mele, Mele Island, being my trial is the only one here. Now that you've cleared the trial, please inform my island Kahuna. Hala. I will, but first I'm going to tell people I'm recording whilst Kakui slowly walks up to us. Uh, trivia lock now. Get ready to trade. And then I'm gonna... Hey there, Liam! Ooh, looking at the expression on Ilima's face, I'd say you cleared your first trial. Yeah, guess I better give you a little reward. Time to learn about sea power. Woo! Okie dokie. Start out by selecting a compatible Z crystal from the Z crystal bucket in your bag. Then choose Z crystal you choose on a Pokemon and a compatible with Pokemon. Blah 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 blah. Z crystal, Z crystal, Z crystal, Z crystals. There we go. Watch and learn, cousin. Oh yeah. Here he goes. Come on, Kukui. Wow, Growlithe appeared. He sent out Rockruff because he's so cool. Rockruff's adorable, though. All right. Here we go. If it's holding Normalium Z, choose a normal type move. And you can see he's using Z power. Check it out. Yep, let's do it. Use Z Leer. I want to see Z Leer at work. Okay, he's going to use Breakneck Blitz. Look at Kukui. He knows what he's doing. Look at that angry little rock rough. He looks so mean. He's like, I'm going to kill you, bish. I'm going to kick your face. Here it comes. Breakneck Blitz. Blah, 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 blah. Yada, yada, yada. Once we escape Mele Mele Island, the game will take its, uh, its grip off of our hand and we'll be able to battle. Just, you know, we'll be able to do what we want to do. Like, I want to go on the next route and get a new Pokemon. Well done. To use Z-Power is heap all of a trainer's feelings onto a Pokemon, yeah? Which totally wears you out. Using Z-Power once per battle is all a team can handle. Yeah. Oh, so that's why you've been looking so ragged, Professor. No, it's like I was hit with amnesia. I forgot I'd lost Lily somewhere on Route 3. Think you could spare some time to help me look for her, Liam? I can go and have a look around the cave for you in case you wanted that way. Oh, okay. Thanks, cousin. Let's split up and find you. Okay, bye, bye. I, I read Ilima's lines in Kukui's voice. It's fine. Let's go on to this route, where we can catch a new Pokemon. Hello. I happened to pass under a moving shadow and got attacked by a wild bird Pokemon. What adorable little pests they are. Right, we need to catch one of them, so let's do it. Let's catch one of these boyids. Like a Spearow. And, uh, you know, oh, haven't we got Crabrawler up front? We have indeed, let's be careful. I mean, it's only a level 11 Spearo, though, so, uh... Let's give it a neutral Rock Smash, because that won't kill it. No, 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 no! Oh! Now we can't catch something on this route. Thank you, Crabrawler, for being stupidly powerful. Ugh. Alright. Isn't she in the meadow? Yeah, she's in the Melee Melee Meadow, so let's... let's. Oh, sugar. Yeah, we'll go in the Melee Melee Meadow... And we'll, uh, we'll attack some Pokemon and catch something in there. Hey, Spearow, you little weakling. Should have used Bubble. Should have used Bubble. Let's use Bubble this time and see what effect it would have had. Oh, look at that. It would have been fantastic. Pursuit. Okay. 
You don't want to use Peck or something that's actually effective. Okay, Rock Smash it. Bang. There we go. Down goes Spiro. No biggie. Good job. And now you're level 16. That's insane. We're, we're, we're all leveling pretty fast. It's kind of scary. So let's head over to this item. Which is da -da -da -da, a sharp beak. Because one of the Pokemon's beaks fell off for some reason. Wait. She wants to fight. Let's do it. Do you have preferences about the type of moves in addition to the type of Pokemon? Uh, I'm alright. My preferences are my business. Thank you very much. Rising star Tatiana. With her Petalil. Oh, that's not a problem. Because we're just going to knock it out with a Brick Break. Are you ready? Here's the Brick Break. Easy does it. And, oh, wait, it lived? Oh, okay. And that was that was a pretty good absorb. Or was that a Mega Drain? Did I, did I miss that? I, I wasn't paying attention. Let's go Rock Smash. Punch it in the face. There we go. Good night, Petalil. Anyone else want to level up? Level 10 for someone. I don't know who, though. <laughs> Who's in our team that's level 10? Because you should probably go at the front. Oh, it's our Pawniard! Oh yeah, I forgot about you! Okay. There, yeah, let's put you... Let's put you there. Then, let's go down here. Because there's an item here, but is there a trainer about? There is! Oi! Each Pokémon possesses an ability. Understanding these leads to victory! Well, it doesn't, because you can understand the ability all you want, but I'm still going to deck you, mate. Here we go, Ian. With your Psyduck. I can take out your Psyduck. I got a Pawniard. We're going to do scary things to you. Let's use Sucker Punch. Because that will be a stab move. Eh, not a bad hit. Psyduck used Water Gun. Oh, oh, oh. That did, that did almost too much damage. So let's switch to our Ghastly. Because that was a little bit too scary. Maybe Pawniard isn't ready for this kind of battle. There's another water gun. I didn't want to risk it. I think he would have lived with 1 HP. She would have lived with 1 HP. But I don't want to risk it because I know you guys would never let me live it down. Oh, Psyduck. Come on. Just, just fall down. Let's go for a lick. And there you go. Good stuff. And a level 19 for our Ghastly. He wants to learn Confuse Ray. I do love a good Confuse Ray. Instead of Mean Luck. Hey, well done. Level 11 for Pawniard. Wonderful. And we beat Ian. Good job. Good job, Ian. So let's go get this item from down here. Oh, bubble trumps. Okay. Oh, hey, Spiro. You're uh, you're looking pretty cool. How about we kill you? Let's go sucker punch. Ooh, now that was a lot better than the battle we just had. Well done, 163 experience. Ooh, you're almost at level 12, darling. Okay, let's get this item, which is well worth getting. It was another heal ball, which is basically, in this playthrough, is basically just a Pokeball, because it doesn't matter if it gets fully healed, because we trade it away. It's an Alolan Rattata. Okay, we can, we can deal with this. We're going to go Revenge, which will be super effective. Okay, you're going Tail Whip. That's a little bit cheeky. I think Alolan Rattata is real cute. It raised our attack. That's wonderful because of our ability. Oh, boy. Good job. Yay, level 12. Good girl. Well done. Well, well done. Right, let's go to the Melee Melee Meadow and find ourselves a Lily. 
I believe this is the wrong way. This is the way into the Mele Mele Meadow. Hell yeah. Well? Well? Nebby, Nebby, come back! Ah, oh, Liam, Nebby ran off into the meadow here. Hey, you can't... Oh, wait, that's not his voice. Mate, you can't catch me, you dumbhead. You stupid knobble. There you go, that's better. Right after he got in so much trouble on the bridge too. What if a wild Pokemon attacks it? It doesn't have any moves it can use to battle. That's because it's dumb. Uh, we can catch Pokemon in this place, so let's be careful. We've got to catch something. Because I want to I wanna catch a Pokemon. I want to do some trivia. Hey, Cottony, how's it going? I think Pawniard will be okay against a Cottony. We'll go for a not very effective Sucker Punch. And hope. Oh, you used Growth. Okay. That raised your attack. And your special attack. Well, that's not good. Let's go for another Sucker Punch. It failed because you used Growth again. Oh, boy. We need to switch Pokemon. Definitely. Don't call for help. What are you doing? <laughs> Stop. What is happening? Oh my god, that should that should not be happening right now. Um, I want to send in my Ghastly, but I'm scared he's going to get destroyed. So in the meantime, I'm going to send in Pangoro. Because then we can heal Ghastly. Ghastly has Hypnosis, which will stop this thing from calling for help. Oh, but Fairy Wind is super effective, four times effective on Pangoro, so we've got to be careful about that. Oh, damn, okay. Uh, let's go with a slash on the Cottony that has the raised attack. Stun Spore didn't affect us. What? Are you serious? There you go. Good job, guys. Alright, we, we need to put it to sleep. So let's switch Pokemon. Switch to Ghastly. Then we can use Hypnosis and we can use Nightshade. Fairy Wind is fine. Don't call for help. Yeah, that did nothing. That's good. Hypnosis. Oh, we avoided the attack. And you avoided our attack. That's annoying. Growth. That's not good. Oh, don't avoid my attack. Come on. Get hit. Oh, of course your stun spore hits. Of course. Come on. There's the Hypnosis. That's good. Now just use Nightshade. And hopefully... Cottony's fast asleep. Don't be paralyzed. Don't be paralyzed. Don't be paralyzed. There we go. That took about half off. That's okay. So let's use... Let's get rid of one of these heal balls. Plus, it's always cool catching a fairy type in a little little pinky purple ball. Come on. Come on. Come on. Hell yeah. Good stuff. Deadly, deadly, deadly. So we got a cottony. Wonderful. Ooh, level 13 for our ponyard. Everyone else is fine. Cottony's data will be added to the Pokedex. Okie dokie. It is the da, 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 da. Cotton Puff Pokemon. When it finds others of its kind, they all stick together. When enough of them have collected, the mass resembles a cu cumulon ugh, cumulonimbus cloud. That is a horrible word to say. Cumulonimbus. We're going to call it Ace, and hopefully you guys are ready to wonder trade. But first, we've got to do some trivia. Oh, we all decided against the whole release a Pokemon if you fail thing, I believe. I believe that was the consensus. Add to our party. I want to add it instead of... Instead of Crabrawler. I feel like... No. I kind of want to get rid of... No, I want to get rid of Crabrawler. I want something else. There you go. So, random number generator. Let's generate... Oh, it's generated number 10. Let's have a look. Out of 100 now, because some extra questions have come through. This one's an old one from Yellow Swellow. In Pokemon Red and Blue, which of the following was true for Lickitung? Okay. Could only learn Lick by leveling up. Had the same front and back sprite. 
had its name misspelled in the Poké Rap, or could only be obtained by trading Hypno on Route 6? Well, the Poké Rap is not Pokémon Red and Blue, that's the anime. Same front and back sprite, I see that unlikely. Could only learn Lick by leveling up. I believe that Lickitung could not learn Lick in Pokemon Red and Blue. So I'm going to go with D. Could only be obtained by trading Hypno on Route 6. Boom. It's incorrect. What was it? C? Had its name spelled misspelled in the Pokemon? That's not fair. That ain't fair. I mean, I'm going to go with it because that's, because that's the... Um... Wait, I want to Google it. Hang on, Lickitung Poke Rap Images. Helps if I spell Poke Rap right. I just want to check. Oh, okay, is that true? Oh. Apparently, Lickitung was spelled wrong in the Poke Rap. Well, uh, I'll, put, I'll flash that on screen for you guys as well. Apparently that's true. Well, that's a bit of a trick question there, Yellow Swallow. That's a bit naughty, but I'll take it, and I'll take the fact that we didn't we didn't get um, a credit for that. That's fine. Okay, let's get Wonder Trade in. Let's see what we can get for this little beastie. Okay. We will connect, and we will hopefully find something lovely to make up for that. But I don't count the Poké Rap as Pokémon Red and Blue. You should have said in Generation 1 or something like that, but... Let's not get into semantics. Okay. It doesn't actually... Do you know what? I was moaning about how long it takes to connect. It doesn't take that long, really, does it? Let's face it. So, we're going to go with Cottony. We're going to trade. We're ready. Yes. Wonder trading now. There we go. Bum, 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 bum. And then what I'll do in the meantime while we're waiting is I'll put another tweet ready. Just in case we get a chance to want to trade something else this episode. Come on, give me a trade partner. What you got for me? Please. Please. Something. Anything. This is taking a while to connect. I mean, there's like 59 seconds left. Where are you all? Hey, there we go. Landon from the United States. Thank you for connecting. Good evening. Wonderful. Here it comes. What are you sending me? Please be good. Please be good. Please be a squirtle. I don't know why I'm so eager for a squirtle, but I really want one. A Gengar? Oh, boy. I love it. By all means. Thanks. Thanks very much. For the, uh, the Gengar. Wow. See, now I feel like we need to trade away our Ghastly. Now we've got Gengar in the Pokedex. Oh, boy. Well, when I get to a Pokemon Center, I guess I will, uh... I guess I'll add someone back to the party. Should you feel yourself attacked by a sudden chill, it's evidence of approaching Gengar. There is no escaping it. Give up. Oh, my God. All right. Let's check out what Gengar has going on. Uh, yeah, let's back out. Oh, I bet it's over-leveled. Uh, Pokemon. Gengar. Yeah, look at that level. Level 52. Shadow Punch, Shadow Ball, Confuse Ray, and Sucker Punch. It has lower attack but increased defense. I mean, that that's fine. And, uh... Yeah. It was found on Memorial Hill, so it's not even been bred. It's just, just a Gengar. Okay, well, uh, let's, let's pop on a little repel. We don't, we don't have any repels, do we? Yeah, we do. We have ten. So we can go talk to Nebby and we can proceed and all that jazz. Let's go. Let's get this item. Hey, there's some nectar over there. I don't care about the nectar. We're not, we're not having an Oricorio anytime soon. Let's go see Nebby. Hey, Nebby, how you doing, dude? You want to go back? Mate, don't sneak up on me like that, you bloody knob. Uh. Oh, there we go. Here's, here's your Nebby back. Oh, you. What do you want? Thank you, Liam. It's all right. And I should thank Ponyard, too. Here, let me at least do this. Yay, heal my Pokemon. 
You know, I read something interesting in a book once. It seems a Pokemon called Oricorio changes appearance by feeding on the nectar from different types of flowers. It's not actually evolving, but undergoing what's uh, a so-called form change. Isn't that interesting? I thought it was anyway. Mate, you're dead boring. Do you read books all day? Back into the bag, please, Nebby. I know there aren't many people around to see you here, but that's hardly an excuse. And I guess we should be going now. Professor will probably be worried after the way we just disappeared on him. Bye then, Lily. No, I don't want to talk to the Professor. Hey, Liam. Oh, and Lily's with you too. What are you up to? What are you up to, How? I just finished my trial. Hey, Liam. I want to see if I really learned anything from my trial. Let me battle you again. Oh, I want to go to the... I want to go to the secret place in the in the meadow. I don't want to face you, Hal. Okay. He sent out Pikachu. Good job. Alright, Pikachu. Get ready. Should we Sucker Punch? Yeah, let's Sucker Punch. Oh, it used Quick Attack. Okay, so Sucker Punch is going to fail, right? Yep. Should we try again? Because that... that Quick attack didn't do much. Oh, he's just going to keep quick attacking. That's really annoying when I'm trying to sucker punch, dude. Okay, let's psycho cut then. Let's go psycho on this thing. Oh, now you use an electro ball. All right. I see what it's like. Get psycho cut, mate. Now we're going to use sucker punch because I reckon you're ready another electro ball. There we go. Get taken down. Can't wait till you're a Raichu and we can destroy you. Level 14 for our Pawniard. Good job. Good job. What's the learned Torment? No thanks. Anyone else? Hurdy is level 20. Probably going to stop listening to us now. Wants to learn Work Up? No thank you. That's an Impoplio. Will I switch Pokemon? Mm. No, I won't. Okay, Poplio. Get ready to get sucker punched. Failed because you used baby doll eyes and lowered my attack, which will activate my ability. Well done. So now I'm at plus one attack. Do you want to use it again? There we go. There's the sucker punch. And Poplio almost went down. Ooh, that water gun though. Yeah, let's let's use a super potion real quick. Do I have Super Potion? Yeah, I do. Just because I don't want to die. And I don't think we outspeed Poplio. So I didn't want to risk it. Okay, not a bad water gun there, mate. We'll go for a cheeky slash. Easy. Down goes Poplio. Jobs are good un. Anyone else want to level up? Nope. There you go, How You can bugger off now. So you and me both beat that totem Pokemon, huh, Liam? Looks like we're getting pretty strong. Wonder if I'll really ever be able to beat my gramps at this rate. Hey there, Liam. I knew I could count on you. Yeah, thanks for tracking Lily down for me. What's this then, How You finished your first trial too? Bet you used some styling moves, yeah? Yeah, right. Hal is probably rubbing his hands together in glee right about now. Oh, yeah. What do you mean? It's a ball part of the trials. After you clear one island's trials, you gotta battle the island's kahuna. Taking on the island kahuna is called the Grand Trial. For some, for someone like me who's researching Pokemon moves, nothing could be better than the chance to see some more fierce Pokemon battles. Woo! I don't know about fierce. I'll be the judge of that. Come on, back to Iki Town. Catch that tailwind and blast through Route 3. Okay, well, I'm gonna go and just catch another Pokemon if that's alright. Here we go. So we'll just whiz through here. Is my repel still active? I think it is. Here we go. We're at the Seaward Cave. We're going to head down and go and check out some uh, some Pokemon. No, don't use repel because I need to catch a Pokemon in here. What's it going to be? A Diglett. That's cute. I need to keep my... Um, I need to keep my Pawniard away from it. But we're going to switch to Ghastly anyway. It'll be the last thing Ghastly does in this team, because now that we've got a Gengar, we might as well switch it out. Oh, there's the Growl, lowering our attack. That's absolutely fine. Let's use Nightshade, and then we'll catch Diglett, and then we'll Wonder Trade. <gasps> oh, that was risky. There's the Mud Slap, which doesn't affect us because of Levitate. 
So we can go ahead and use a ball. Let's use a heal ball. Oh, I'm sure someone's going to complain at some point about me not using the Y button to access the Pokeball and going all the way through the bag. Just, just calm down. It's not that big of a deal. With all the things going on in the world, there we go, caught the Diglett. There's bigger things to worry about than me pressing too many buttons. Trust me, I'm not going to get Carpal Tunnel, I'll be fine. There we go, so we caught Diglett, which is the mole Pokemon, I know that much. And we've got to get ready to Wonder Trade, I hope you lot are all ready. Here we go. Its head spots an altered form of Whiskers made of metal. When in communication with its comrades, its Whiskers wobble to and fro. I'll give it a nickname. I'll call it Ace, because that's what I call all these Pokemon that were Wonder Trading out. Even if they don't suit girls. Girls can be Ace. I've met some Ace girls in my time. Here we go. Let's go and swap our Ghastly. And we're going to Wonder Trade anyway. So let's do it. Festival Plaza. Do, 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 do. Wonder Trizzle. Here we go. I am ready. My body is ready. I'm hyped. I want to catch... Uh, not catch. I want to receive something amazing. Here we go. Please let me wonder trade. Start. So we're wonder trading away this diglet. Wait. But first, we need to do some trivia. That's what we didn't do. So let's do some trivia. Random number generator. 81. From Candy Eevee. To evolve Feebas into Milotic, which stat needs to be raised? Is it, is it cuteness, coolness, beauty, or toughness? That's easy. That's C. Beauty. And of course it's correct. Wonderful. So we actually got a new credit, which is fantastic. So, let's wonder trade away this Diglett. And do it. There we go. And in the meantime, I will highlight this so that I know when I edit which questions were asked and answered. Thank you, Lucy, for that lovely easy question. Beautiful. You can also trade it holding a prism scale, I believe. Or is it just level it up? Hold no, I think it's trade it holding a prism scale. Hello, so this is Yas from Spain. Let's do this. What are you giving me, Yas? Dude, tomorrow's episode is going to be the Grand Trial. That's going to be awesome. Come on, something crazy good. It's in a Great Ball. A Diglett? What is this? What is this? Oh. Okay, this is stupid. We got a Diglett for a Diglett. Ah, oh, right. Well, this is this is one where we can re-roll it without spending a credit. Uh, let's go. Trade. Wonder trade. Start. Because we got a Diglett back in exchange for a Diglett. We just got, um, it's practically the same level. It's practically the same Diglett. Okay, ready? Trade. Fire. That was stupid. There we go. Let's get another tweet ready. Come on, Diglett. Give it to me. Okay, Sun from the United States. Please don't give me another Diglett. I'll be very unhappy. Give me something good. Ooh, regular Pokeball. Makuhita! <laughs> I'm using a credit. I don't even care. I'm using a credit. I don't want a Makuhita. Just, just no. We want something crazy. Come on, guys. It's fine. It's fine. Good job this is towards the end of the episode. <laughs> okay. Wonder Trade. Oh, take a credit off. There we go. Now this time we have to use a credit because it's not the same Pokemon. Here we go. So after this Makuhita, we can't Wonder Trade the result again. So we have to stick with what we get. 
Whether or not it goes in the PC is, is another another story. But we shall see. Off you go, Makuhita. Dennis from Germany. Lower Saxony. Nice to meet you, great. Cool, let's do it. My word, this has been a pain. Please, Dennis, I'm begging you, Dennis. Come on. An Eevee! I'll take it! I'll take it! Thanks, Eevee. Da -da 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 -da. Nice one. Eevee's data will be added to the Pokedex. That's lovely. Look at that crowded page. Jolly good. The evolution Pokemon. Possessing an unbalanced and unstable genetic makeup, it conceals many possible evolutions. And you know what? I'm going to put a straw poll on my Twitter because I don't want to spoil the episode so you guys know in advance that we get an Eevee. So what I'm going to do, if you're following me on Twitter at Ace Trainer Liam, which you should be because that's where all my updates are, I will put a straw poll on there for you guys to vote on which evolution we should go with for our Eevee, which is going to stay in our party for quite a while. I'll probably swap out Herdia. Let's just check on Eevee's stats. So Eevee has lower attack and increased defense. So really we want a special attacking Eevee. So we'd say Jolteon, Glaceon, Sylveon, Vaporeon, or Espeon. Because Leafeon, Flareon, and Umbreon are more physical. So Sylveon, Espeon, Glaceon, Jolteon or Vaporeon are your options. Beautiful. And it has run away, which, you know, that's the that's the basic Eevee um, ability. Is she level one? Uh, I can't remember. God, the music here is creepy. Yeah, she's level one, but that's fine. So I'm going to save here because we'll explore a little bit more of this cavern in tomorrow's episode before our grand trial. But thank you for watching. Remember, follow me on Twitter, otherwise you don't get to vote. Thank you for watching, hit like if you enjoyed this video, and of course hit subscribe so you never miss a video from me. But until next time, I'm Ace Trainer Liam, keep on training.